Hey, Mike Wrigley, Certified Default Advocate, Distressed Property Expert, and Short Sale Specialist here. Welcome to our video blog. As default advocates and short sale specialists, we want homeowners to know all their options. Whether you're behind in your payments, possibly facing foreclosure, or maybe you just owe more than your home is worth, we want you to know that we're here to help. So the big news this week is Bank of America has offered uh, to offer to some homeowners extra assistance under the $25 billion settlement. Under the $25 billion foreclosure settlement signed last month, Bank of America will offer the write down loans of more than 200,000 underwater homeowners to market value. Now, Bank of America must offer this deal to any borrowers who meet a certain set of criteria. The homeowners must be underwater, which means they owe more than their home is worth. They must be delinquent by more than 60 days on their mortgage payments, and their mortgage payments must account for more than 25% of their income. Now, Bank of America, which is embroiled in many other legal battles over the servicing misconduct, wanted more than the other banks to get the Attorney General investigation behind it, so it's offered a more complete principal reduction as an incentive to get the deal done. A Bank of America uh, spokesman stated that the program expands on other targeted principal reduction programs they offer to address the large volume of delinquent legacy countrywide loans. And the goals are the same, to keep as many troubled borrowers in their homes as possible, reduce foreclosures, and help stabilize the housing market. The deal, which was reached February 9th, but has not yet been finalized, requires Bank of America, J.P. Morgan Chase, Citigroup, Wells Fargo, and Ally, who was GMAC, Ally Financial, to provide at least $10 million in principal reductions to underwater borrowers who are delinquent or in medium risk of default. Borrowers whose loans are held by uh, the other banks won't get as much relief. Under the, under the agreement, they only have to reduce principal to 120% of fair market value. If your home is worth 100, you owe 200, the most you're going to get the reduction down to is 120,000, meaning you're still going to owe 20% more than what your house is worth. All told, the settlement would offer financial assistance to between 750 and possibly a million homeowners. Now, as certified default advocates, we want homeowners to know all their options. So call the number below. Sleep better tonight. You'll be happy you did. We'll see you soon.